So much excitement went down last night during Super Bowl 50. So much so that a team winning the actual game was the least of the chatter. So right now we're breaking down 11 of the best game day internet memes. Today's episode of Clever News Feed is brought to you by T-Mobile, the uncarrier. From Lady Gaga's performance to Beyonce's almost fall to an honorary left shark, the internet never ceases to find ways to make memorable moments that much better. Yesterday's 50th Super Bowl kicked off in Santa Clara, California on a super high note and a low note and basically all of the notes in between as Lady Gaga slayed the national anthem, but it wasn't her voice that the World Wide Web decided to pick apart. Nope, one meme compared her sparkly red custom Gucci two-piece suit and matching eyeshadow to the Hunger Games Epi Trinket, saying, when you gotta sing the national anthem at 6.30, but host the Hunger Games at 8. And I just have to mention that an entire article was also dedicated to things that Lady Gaga looked like last night, which completely gave me life, including, but not limited to, the Heat Miser, Dracula, Dolly Parton, Davy Jones, Stuffed Garlic Knot Pizza, and Jack Frost. In the best ways possible, of course. Moving right along to the actual game, because apparently people are here to see a team win and not just the halftime show. Apparently one player couldn't quite get the perfection that was Grease live out of his head because the Panthers running back Jonathan Stewart's touchdown victory freakishly resembled that of the hand jive, and obvi the internet started singing along. And then there was that one time that Coldplay was set to headline the Super Bowl, but the Twittersphere was apparently more entertained by the other acts who accompanied Chris Martin and his band, with this picture of him looking like he had just witnessed an angel in heaven for the first time. But let's be real, he pretty much did. Writing, even Chris Martin can't believe he's allowed to perform with Beyonce. Other memes revived the role of last year's Left Shark, with this Snapchat saying, Left Shark is just waiting for the halftime show. While another meme even took things as far as comparing Coldplay to Left Shark, writing, Chris Martin was the Left Shark of this year's halftime show. Apparently, Coldplay was also overlooked by Empire star Taraji P. Henson as she captioned a photo from the game awkwardly mistaking the UK band with Maroon 5. Ouch. And the internet went into a frenzy, sparking this meme with the popular crying dude cropped onto Chris's head. But don't worry, cooks, it's all good because apparently Chris Martin was also confused about his placement in the B and Bruno show. And in super creepy meme news, some users even argued that Coldplay would have been better with the creepy Mountain Dew commercials, Puppy Monkey Baby, we all had nightmares about last night. A few comical tweets even made their way to the popular pages. One user writing, quote, I don't know why they keep saying Coldplay featuring Beyonce. You don't say the Son and the Holy Spirit featuring the Father. Super Bowl 50 was indeed a great game, however, some memes are dubbing the real MVP to Beyonce for making the best play of the evening when she almost took a fall on stage, but covered it up in the best way possible. The caption alongside the gif of B recovering perfectly wrote, best play of the game was Beyonce saving herself from falling in front of millions of people. Slay queen. But I think I speak for all of us here when I, along with this meme, believe that the best halftime show to this day is still SpongeBob's marching band. Many users took this as an opportunity to never forget the legendary performance put on by SpongeBob SquarePants and his bikini bottom buds, writing things like, what the halftime show really should have been, and still the greatest halftime show of all time. So whether you agree or not, I still want to know what your favorite Super Bowl meme was, and if there's one I didn't mention, feel free to shout it out right down here in the comment section. After that, don't forget to click right over here to check out all the highlights from last night's halftime show featuring Coldplay, not Maroon 5, Beyonce, and Bruno Mars. Thanks so much for hanging out with me here on Clever News. I'm your host, Sinead DeFries, and I'll see you guys next time. Click to the left to check out five other shocking Super Bowl halftime show moments throughout the years, and click to the right to check out a few of this year's best Super Bowl commercials. We'd like to thank our sponsor, T-Mobile, the network that doubled its LTE coverage in the last year. Join the millions who switched to T-Mobile today.